Okay. So I was pondering the ability of doing, pondering the uh, possibly doing skits, improv skits, probably some scripted too, too. Uh, animations, 2, 2D and 3D, either or. Uh, bots and B2B will be staying no matter what. Oh, B2B. Now, B2B. Uh, that was one of my real early original series on this channel. Uh, it was Back to Basics. It was fully called Back to Basics, but we always called it B2B. Which stood for Back to Basics. Ba anyway, point is, uh, what we... What, what, uh, all we were doing was we just had, we were just playing, there's just a bunch of guys talking and playing different games. Uh, that didn't really work too well. We got two videos out, one with me and Assassin, and another with me, Assassin, and Whirlwind. Uh, which, the second one turned out way better than the first one, because we had three people. So that worked much better. More more people, more topics of conversation. It's simple map. It's simple. It's simple commentation. It's simple commentator logic. Uh, so after that, I uh, did, I real I uh, talked to some more people, and I realized. That's not really a new that's a re not really a new idea, but uh, that's new on YouTube. But everyone pretty much does that. It's just called sitting in a call. So I thought it would. I thought I was hoping it'd be some. Un yeah, I, I. For all honesty, I was original original to YouTube, but everyone does that. No one wants to watch a video of that. They just, they do it with their own friends. They interact with their own friends like that. Uh, beyond that, uh, after that, I, after a long, long time, uh, not too long ago, actually, I tried to reboot the series as a podcast. Welcome back. Gonna get I, uh, well, I don't really know. Would that sour you on buying more? They're scale replicas of the real thing. Very detailed. Got a liquid in them that makes them glow. From what I hear, Repcon used to give them out on tours of their HQ up in Henderson. But I guess they had to stop after the first few kids thought they were filled with Nuka-Cola and drank it down. The papers had a name for the condition and everything. They called it the Repcon Shakes. Those were bad times for Robco. Well, they unloaded what they had left on the dino bite as a tax write-off, but that was before my time. Plenty of demand for them, seeing as how they're one-of-a-kind collector's items, but... I... Really? I never thought I'd see the day. I mean, the day I'd part with them for such an incredibly low price, with so many other offers flooding in. But I like you. I think maybe it's time. All that's left is in the storage room here. Sure thing. Have a look. Okay, uh, so I reimagined B2B as like a multi, a, as a podcast. Uh, it was kind of like a multi, 
is something of a uh, multi-person thoughts video. I, I assume everyone, if you're in the future and reading this, uh, right as of recording, thoughts is my second biggest series. Uh, after it's my second, it's thoughts is pretty much my golden boy. I can always rely on my thoughts videos to get views. Uh, I can always, just as I can always rely on Fallout to get views. Right now, Fallout's kind of new, so Fallout's getting a lot more views. But, as far as the test of time goes, Fawts has withstood it. Hey, Fawts was my first original series, period. Uh, Fawts, uh, it started as Hold Nothing Back, then it was, then it got the iconic Fawts title. It was DK's thoughts on my old channel. Then it got sh changed into Neon's thoughts when I changed. The components we discussed. There. Yes, that's Isotope 239, all right. And there's enough here to launch the rockets. Now all I need. Repcon has been ransacked so many times by scavengers. It's hard to know where the components might turn up, if they turn up. Jason has mentioned some industrial ruins to the east that are supposed to be highly radioactive. But... Uh... Crap, what was... Uh... Uh... Thoughts has always been my golden boy. Thoughts has gotten me views consistently. Has got consistently gotten views for almost my entire career. It it came out of a slump. Uh, I was I recall it was I was in a slump. I could only do a video every three days because I was just I wasn't really busy. I was just lazy and. I was at a point where I was just I was doing two let's plays, both of which I was not having much fun with, cause uh, Earthbound, cause I always had to babysit uh, Paula, and the level scaling was crap as heck. Uh, though I I am going to be picking up the pieces on that let's play, and uh, I was was also doing Final Fantasy VII, which. I enjoyed, but I just wasn't getting any views on. And it's hard to build a channel when when you're loving it, but no one else is. Oh, we got company, boys. One clip, one, one clip, four ghouls dead. Uh, uh thoughts came out of a slump. And it became one of my best series, best received series I've ever done. So, I've got an, I've got an idea that's kicking around in my skull. I'm just trying to find the right team to put it together. And if it does... Uh, I'm... And if it does, it'll be. Gr I think it'll be. I think it'll be. Int I think. N more. I'm more concerned with having fun with it than getting views. I'm. I'm partially. If a video. If a series will go like five videos without getting like five or six videos without getting any views, then I'll typically. I'll typically uh, keep an eye on that series to see if it 
get a, make a few more series and videos, and then keep an eye on that series. Make sure it's make sure it's still produce it's still producing. Even if I really love that series, I'll keep an eye on it. And uh, and make sure it's st it's still producing good fruit for me. I'm still putting in work. And if it doesn't, I'll have to. No matter how much I like it, I have to scrap it. That was kind of the story with. Technically, I could have reboot. I could have restarted my. I. Who's shooting? Who be shooting? Hi there. I'm Old Lady Gibson, or so they tell me. I've got odds and ends for sale, and I'm pretty good at fixing things, too. You might have noticed the very large building just north of here. That's Helios 1. The NCR runs the place, so it's off limits to prospectors. As it so happens, I do have some thrust modules, but they're expensive. 500 caps worth of expensive. Yes, you are quite the smooth talker. What the hell? Two fifty, it is. Pleasure doing. So, oh, well, no matter, I've, I love doing, I uh, love doing this. I prefer to do something I have fun with. But, be perfectly honest, I'm, I'm fairly easily entertained. Uh. So, yeah, I don't, I, I can typically make things fun for myself, because I can just be a total goofball and have a bunch of fun, because, like, like, uh, we do, I, so, something that, um, when me and Assassin were hanging out, and, uh, so, something I didn't think, no offense to the dude, but something I didn't really think was that, uh, smart to do, and I hope he learns from, I hope he learns in the future not to do that, uh, he deleted all the outtakes, all the videos that, uh, didn't really fit the motif, and uh, so we did. We did eventually go back and uh, remake those, but but uh, we did, for the skit we did, it was real weird. But uh, I had a great, old, grand old time. I was doing the Bee Gees dance. I was doing the Bee Gees walk, and I was Baywatch running, and I was just a total goofball. <laughs> and every. Like, Everyone that was helping us was just like cracking up whenever I'd do something. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Dude, I can't see you. And I'm also pondering, like, I want, I'm, I finally found my script after, I found my script that I wrote for the uh, countdown I was going to do like months ago. I finally found where I put it on my hard drive. And I'm thinking if I actually do that, I'm pondering, uh, whether I want to bit, get, like, a like, a green screen and just, like, uh, put a green screen up and just do little out, do little stuff with me being there. Just do random things uh, while I'm talking about the games. Uh, I like. Uh, I'm planning on putting in a little bit of work every day on the uh, countdown because I want that. I want to do that now. Have you found the components? We Indeed, you did. 
And they seem to be in excellent condition. Yes, I'll tell Jason that the great journey can begin. The rockets are ready, Jason. The great journey can begin. Good luck, I guess. Gather all. May the Creator guide my words and help me speak true. The Almighty Creator has seen fit to answer our prayers. The time has come for us to board the rockets and begin the great journey. Though it may seem that all humans despise us, the Creator has seen fit to instruct us differently. So, back to what I was saying. Uh, I want to do the countdown because if I can get some serious views with that, it might bring some more. I I personally enjoy watching like Space Hamster, PBJ, and Pro Jared back in the day. I enjoy watching character guys like that do uh, their countdowns because they they make real good content. see uh, they make real good content to be perfectly honest I really enjoy it and I kind of want to experiment with that and make my own countdown just to see if I like it because if I like it and I enjoy it uh, then it'll be a grand old time I'll make a bunch of them probably the best thing probably <laughs> Probably something that would be the best would be if uh, it got you know, it was fun to make, it was fun to watch, and it got a ton of views. That would be epic. If I could get all th if I could get those three things, I don't really care what else I get. I don't really care what it's about. I just w want those three things. Come fly with me, come fly, let's fly away. Can I fly it? Nope, I cannot fast travel from this location. Shining Imperialist. Got my num got my keys all mixed up. Okay, now let's go talk to uh, Manny Vargas and uh, get my booty out of here. Get my pootis out of here.
Let's see, how long have I been, even been recording? 45, 46 minutes. Dang. You don't even notice it. I really, really hope I didn't screw anything up on the audio. Please tell me I didn't screw anything up. Actually, if I was... Actually, I could probably just make it back to uh, Novak and let you guys go, and then it would be good. Stretch! <sighs> Taste, toss my salad, Caesar. Uppercut. Why do you have to be 75 unarmed to do cross? Cross? Crossing? A cross attack, a, a punch, a cross punch is one of the easiest, easier punches to do. Hey, it's Boone! No offense, but I need to focus on getting more rest when I'm off duty. I'm not, if you want to talk, catch me when I'm on duty. Do, 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 do. Well, you have any luck with the ghouls? I'm counting on. Really? Unbelievable, man. I knew that wasn't going to be easy. But I had a good feeling about you. Okay, I'll tell you everything I know, like I promised. The guy you're looking for, Benny, he was traveling with some members from my old gang. They were going to Boulder City. It's straight up Route 93 from here. Just keep following the road north. No clue. I know Benny hadn't paid up yet. Maybe that was where they were supposed to get square. Hope that helps. I owed you. Were they tough? I was in the cons, man. It doesn't get any badder. Oh, it was great. I wouldn't trade it. Something about that lifestyle, the discipline, seeing new places, making people safe. What's not to like? Uh, well, I just felt like it was time, you know? Wanted to have a home. Plus, I was up at Camp Golf when Bitter Springs went down. I faked like I was sick to get out of going because I knew some of the people there. But when everybody came back, nobody would tell me what happened, and people would call us murderers sometimes when we showed up to secure towns. I still don't know exactly. Just that a lot of people died who didn't want to be a part of the fighting at all. I don't blame anybody for it. There's so much chaos when you're fighting. You're lucky not to shoot your own guys. But it did take something out of it for me. This wasn't the same. So when it came time to re-enlist, I just took my papers and walked. Come on in. Okay. Well, I've battled on quite a bit. So, uh, hope you guys enjoy. Neon, signing out.